thanks to our team um, for what I'm going to do with the creator and user. User will be CCX supervisor. This will be CCX so supervisor. Gonna do it, just save it. And device associate to our Monica chain. Back. IPCC. To here to the group, gonna use standards and users. So, can you use CTI standard user? Now save it. Now we have created CCX supervisor. What we're going to do, go back to the subcomment as uh, UCCX under two supervisor copy wheel. Now we're going to as our CCX supervisor that's it and make a team gonna make a name customer server primary C supervise CCX secondary resource CSQ. Now we have it. Check save. Each um, uh, first a script, but before that, I'm going to show you uh, what to, uh, requires is uh, our region. The region only have one region, region on YST, and because I know the UCCX and now uh, supports only support the G711, so we're going to change region to the south, G711, default G711. So in this lab, we use G711. All right, um, I'm going to show you the Monica chain is already logging as a supervisor, and I'm going to see a client uh, agent, Charles Holland, is also ready. He is ready. So, our agents are in the ready state. So what we're gonna do? We're gonna do is to logging a UCCX editor. So in here we will open up our first script. Oh, my first script. Save it as standard one. All right. Let's see what's in it. Open up. All we have here is are the two variables. First variable agent, you type it user, 
And while we're CSID, string is USCSKU. That's what we're gonna route it to. From the start, we accept the call and we just select the resources. Resource, of course, there will be the CSQ ID, which is our US CSQ. Resource, will you choose the agent, that's only the agent, and we'll connect to the agent. Connect to the agent, and if we connect it, we go in the call, fail, we end the call. We have a go to label to the end label. If it's cute, we make a call hold. Okay, that's our first script that's uploaded to UCCX. Head back to UCCX under script application script manager. We will create it to standard folder and we will upload our first script. There you go. Return. Let's install a configure our application. Name will be a standard. Give it ID a thousand because that's the number we're going to use. Uh, Ten session. Choose our script. Save it. Go ahead, open a new trigger. <laughs> 